Yo, what's up guys? It's Mace here back at it again with another video and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to separate your audios in OBS. Before we get into that, make sure you guys drop a like on this video, subscribe down below and turn on the post notification bell. And yeah, let's get right into the video. So the first step that you guys are going to want to do is go to this website. It's going to be linked down in the description below. And pretty much this is the plugin to let you separate all your audios. So all you're going to want to do is click on the most recent version, which during this recording is October 31st. So all you're going to want to do is click on when capture audio version 2.1.0. Yes, it is still a beta, but it works completely fine. I've had no issues with it. And then you're just going to want to download the exe file so once you have the setup downloaded you just go through the process of setting it up it's really easy to do you just accept the agreement and then pretty much all you do is just click install and then it should be good to go and so now i'm going to show you guys how to set it up in obs so the first thing i would do is set up a new scene and call it audio setup pretty much so then you don't accidentally mess up any of your other scenes and also you can test out the different audios and see how they work it's pretty straightforward the first thing i would would recommend doing is just setting up your microphone for this you're just going to want to click on audio input capture and then you're just going to want to select your microphone which for me is the focus right usb audio this is where it gets a little bit different as you can see at the top of your sources there is a new audio capture application audio output capture and this is pretty much going to separate all your different audios it's really simple to do you're just going to want to set it to a specific window and then you can literally select whichever audio you want to capture so for me i'm just going to capture discord and then you just keep match title and then you don't change anything else everything is good to go and then you can add as many as you want so i'm going to go ahead and add two more one for my games and then one for music so now as you guys can see i have all three of my audio set up and they're right here on the bottom left side of the screen and so now i'm going to go ahead and play some non-copyright music and you guys should see that it shows up in the music mixer. And then what I like to do after I have all my sources done is selecting all my audio and then grouping them together. And then you can take this group and put it into all of your scenes. And other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any questions or concerns, let me know down in the comments. And other than that, I'll be seeing you guys later. Peace out.